Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. My name is Rob and in today's video I'm going to show you how you can clean up your PC, clear out some space, potentially solve some issues you might be having. So let's get started. So this is my Windows 11 virtual machine. I got it running on Hyper-V and it looks like this. So for the first thing we're going to clear up is we are going to the C drive, we're going to Windows, and over here, i got to look for it, Software Distribution. This folder is used by Windows to download updates and all that kind of stuff, and from here it installs all the updates to your Windows machine. It's done, you don't need it, and if it does need it, it will download it again. So that's the first one done. Second one is we are going to the temp folder. Yep. And here it stores a lot of application and temporary files. This is also for Windows. And we can delete everything we don't need. So start, type CMD. And make sure you can run it as an administrator. And you type in ip config forward slash flash dns. What this does, it clears out your DNS cache and potentially fixes domain name resolving issues. That's a mouthful. Maybe even connectivity problems you might be having. And it's flushed. Another one is press Windows R or you can just right mouse button click and run it. And now what you want to do is you want to type in prefetch. In this folder it stores a lot of information about frequently used application. This speeds up the start of a lot of applications. Next time you run an application it might be a bit slower but then from there it will be fast again. It needs to rebuild the cache, right? You can actually see it rebuilding now. Another one, Windows R, or just run it. And you type in this one, temp. This is a different temp folder. And this is the temp folder for the user. You can see user Rob one application data. What it does here, it stores a lot of temporary files for the current user. It's just for me. And you can delete that as well. Just press Ctrl A if you want to select everything. Now we do Windows R again. So we get the run box. And type in WS Reset. What this does is it resets your Microsoft Store. Potentially solving issues you might be having. It removes cache and all that stuff that it doesn't need continuously. But it does not remove any data and it does not remove any applications. Depending on your system and how much you have going on here, it may take a little bit. I don't, so it is quite fast. Another one is Chrome. I'm not signed in, but you go to your top right hand corner to these three little things, the dots. Go to your settings, go to your privacy and security, and over here you will find delete browser data. When you click on it, you can delete everything from the last hour, 24 hours, well you have your options here. But you can also check what you want to have deleted. Okay, I want to delete it, there's nothing there, but it's for the video. Another one is, go to your windows, go to your settings. Go to your privacy and security, scroll down a bit, and over here you'll find location. You can clear that as well. Another one we have is go to your windows, and now we type in just disk, and we get this pop-up box. We have a lot of stuff we can select here. Recycle bin, that's all the data we just deleted, temporary files. There's a lot of stuff here. And after you made your selection, click OK. And 
And that's how you clean up your PC, clear out some space, potentially fix issues you might be having. And yeah, that's what I wanted to share. If you like the video, like it. If you want to see more videos like this, subscribe. Sharing would be wonderful. And I'll see you in the next video. Thank you. Bye-bye.